Now on January 6th, this morning, the Senate Homeland Committee, Homeland Security and Government Affairs Committee, in partnership with the Rules Committee, released a joint report related to the aspects of the tragedy of January 6th. I particularly salute Chair Chairs Peters and Klobuchar for the good work they have done with their ranking members. The report drew a few notable conclusions, especially with respect to fa failures in intelligence gathering and communication that took place on and before January the 6th. But just as glaring is what the report didn't consider. Indeed, what was not allowed, it was not allowed to consider. The report did not investigate, report on, or hardly make any reference to the actual cause, the actual impetus for the attack on January the 6th. With the exception of a brief reference to former President Trump's remarks at the ellipse, Senate Republicans insisted that the report exclude anything having to do with the cause of the insurrection. If anything, the joint report by the Homeland Security and Rules Committees has strengthened the argument for an independent commission on January the 6th. We had a perfect opportunity to establish such a commission at the end of last session before Republicans mounted a partisan filibuster against it. Despite the fact that the Democrats worked with Republicans for weeks in the House and Senate to construct a commission that was bipartisan, focused, straight down the middle. Despite the fact that Speaker Pelosi acceded to every major request made by House Republicans about the structure of the commission. And despite the fact that here in the Senate, I have supported the changes proposed by my colleague, Senator Collins. As the big lie continues to spread, as faith in our elections continues to decline, it is crucial, crucial, we establish a trusted, independent record of what transpired on January 6th and what caused it. So I reserve the right to bring legislation for an independent bipartisan commission to the Senate floor for another vote.